Hi everyone, this is Sangeeta. Sangeeta is the hell. I, I want to talk to people and say that nothing is easy. It's never ever easy to achieve success. More than, more than uh, the successes that you see, there are many, many failures behind that. I'm not a climber. I was never a climber. I was never a runner. Since last two weeks, I started running. And I've struggled. And I've struggled so hard to see that my heart rate was okay. I was uh, walking in a balance. It's the same with life. There is nothing that will come to you easily unless you work hard. I only know one thing that I have worked hard all my life. There's never been a chance or a time that I've said to opportunities that yes, my opportunities have always been gifts for me to try, gifts for me to see what my progress will be. I never said no to anything, including training here. As you all know, I climb Mount Everest at an age when people mostly give up. <clears throat> so now my progress will continue. It's never going to stop one day and like I'm done. I'm not done. I'm just starting a new learner in running. This whole week I've been on a flat surface and today I came to the biodiversity to try my hand and see how far I could go. And it all came to a point that I struggled on uphill. I really struggled. <clears throat> there were times I was going to give up. But today, after doing about 5 km yesterday, today was supposed to be a recovery for me. But I said, let me just push it and see how far I can go. So today I've done 6.5 struggling very very hard I want to bring this word struggling because without struggle there is no success there is plenty plenty of hard work that you will see in your life and that hard work will pay off eventually it will pay off eventually it will uh, pay dividends to what you're really made of so basically all your life the struggle is within you. There is no competition. You can see people who are struggling very hard to make it. Do you think they made it just like that? They haven't made it just like that. They've made it with patience and persevering and always uh, having a feeling that yes, they will get to where they want. Last year when I came from Everest, I, I was dejected because I hadn't summited. So I tried my hand at uh, doing a 10K, which I did because I trained about an, a month and I made that. So now my goal is if it comes to that and, and if it's really needed, I'll do the half marathon at some point before my next climb because I think I'm very getting very good at uh, <laughs> running. <clears throat> Even though my knee gives a trouble a little while, but then unless you push it, you can't get it. So guys, today is midweek. Midweek is when people start to go down and they say, okay, Saturday, Sunday, we'll do something. But midweek is when you really pick up and do something for yourself today. It doesn't necessarily have to be running. It doesn't necessarily have to be uh, <clears throat> something that uh, requires you to be outdoors. It could be something even indoors in your corporate world, in your business, personally, do make a change today and make sure that you continue doing it to get to success. I'll give you an example. People who are wanting to lose weight, give up one thing today which will take you to your goal. And I think that itself will uh, give you a good goal to look up to. <clears throat> People who want to lose weight, either exercise or give up some sort of food, which is like 80% nutrition and 20% is exercise. So nutrition is, guys, whatever you eat, you become. So there you go. I'm going to run back to the car now.
because I'm feeling satisfied and so should you because you can do it and I will talk to you once again bye for now